Hello everyone, how good of you to join. Welcome back to the high seas out here. No, don't worry, we are not going into a full war here with um, Leo. We are actually on our way doing a mission for him right now, picking up some flotsam that is right around the coast of his um, island. Problem though is, of course, that we should be careful of the other adversaries that are on the way here. Um, I've got two now of these guys here and I will need one more that is... Oh, pretty far away there on the other side so let's get going and of course also let's make sure that my ships are protected at all costs you never know what's happening out here there's of course not only miss hunt there's also the pirate somewhere over here with a big boy and this is really a dangerous ship um, we can repair our fisheries by the way in the meantime in vega and i would also like to upgrade a few more people because we can do this we have still 1700 workers right now and i definitely want to get a few more artisans in for the taxes of course but also for the things we can unlock with them all right eli also offers us a destruction quest there they can be dangerous i don't want to risk losing a ship at the moment uh we need to destroy one frigate though so that should be pro uh, without a problem with a bit of money um yeah i think we're going ahead with this let's get the flotsam and i think there it is we can turn it in right away so this is a nice coincidence there these quests could be way worse for us right i've had sessions where <laughs> you have to pick up the flotsam at the pirate space so this is this is actually pretty lucky for us at the moment and we can avoid the pirate this way a bit a bit longer here so i don't need to get into his into his area there there you go we can turn in the quest and that's some money and way more important for me right now though is the repetition there's the frigate that is blocking eli's harbor at the moment so why not just get over there casually i don't see a pirate ship close by there they are at the moment and behind us right so we should have a clear clear path over there for the moment how's it going with my ship of the line still two more minutes the most important warship that we can have early on and I think also, yep, my new world expedition requires our attention once more. And your ship is pinned on the razor sharp corral. So send a team of divers to cut the ship free or make or use something cleverer to break free. Like what? A cunning way, all right, with the planks that we have. Yeah, well, I know that we will lose building materials with that. And I know that a new world expedition usually doesn't fail that much. So let's just go ahead. And they can barely hold their breath for long enough. So one of the divers slices his foot open on a shank of corral. Uh, okay, tend to his foot. We have schnapps on board. <laughs> so this, and although your medic does take immediate action, uh, scrubbing the wound and flushing with fresh water, the corral cut takes a surprisingly long time to properly heal. We lose some morale there, but that is totally fine. Totally fine, that is. All right, my ships are on the way now. Look at the pirate, he's scattering. Or she's scattering here something, I don't know what. Uh, we could flatter at this point, it's medium high. Medium high, uh, alright, with Benta it worked. Mm, let's give Benta also a bit of money there. And yeah, we can definitely give him something though, right, also. So this is the money that he actually paid us for the quest, we can give it back to him. And get another three repetition there right away. With Miss Hunt... Things are looking very dire, so there's no chance here at all. Ah, and also the pirates. Okay. The higher our repetition with the pirate is, also, the, l the, the, the less amount they demand from us, right? For the ceasefire. Alright, back in Vega. We should check out our production there at the moment. It's looking, it's looking actually pretty good. Sausage is down there at the moment. So this is something we need to fix. That means let's go ahead with two more pig farms and two more slaughterhouses. Let's also build another warehouse then for the area. And since we have enough timber, no fish is fine, fish. right? Uh, work cloth wise, we still have a bit of room here to, to expand. And also for the schnapps should also be fine. I would like to do another quick um, city expansion, right? So this whole district here is not used at the moment. And we can do this, of course. We have the main road here with the bridge going over. And we can just continue with it. Um, question is, how should we do this? There's the main road, so let's make the connection here. Probably a bit further over like this. Right, and then we make the connection here. This could work. We can still fiddle around here a bit. And let's also make sure that we have a proper road along the, uh, along the, the river. Just like that. Perfect. 
where we can build some houses along, right? Definitely something like that. This is looking good. Um, Streetwise, I will also work, to be honest. We'll just see. Let's go ahead, have another marketplace area then here. And by the way, this is a main road, of course, so we should probably also make sure that this is triple, triple wise. And I think we have a good, a good message there. Ladies and gents, there it is, our first ship of the line. A beauty, isn't it, under the banner of the cat? This is all that I need. This is a very, very good ship. And PC Italian, of course, once again. Um, Thank you for your support. And with this, once again, I'm honoring you with the mightiest ship that we can have for a very long time. And in that case, let's hope that it doesn't sink. Where is that frigate? It has moved quite a lot, so holy cow, it's further in the south now. So let's let's move. Let's try to get it. It's really fast though. And this is what I can see a quest line, right? So Eli the Incorruptible Part 1. And Eli is having a hard time accepting that one of his prisoners has been pardoned because they have friends in high places. He suggests you take the matter outside of the law and sink his ship. Right, that's what we are doing. We have a very profitable soap business with Eli and I want to stay on good terms with him. Alright, Billaway has some rights. Let's also make sure that we do have a police station close by. I do have my space here behind the... Ah, oh, it's not working. Oh, we can make this work. Or we make it like that. That would also work fine. And then I have this room here for the school that I'm going to need at some point as well for these guys. But a police station, of course, is absolutely required. And for the bread, I would like to continue since we have a bit of cash right now. I would like to continue getting that production further up so we can build another flour mill and then two more bakeries. And definitely we need another warehouse then as well. I continue in the meantime with my city expansion. So I would like to have a double road here. Um, and then we had the marketplace somewhere. That would be totally fine in this area. Get it and also with a pub. cause people some happiness right and then we could have probably a school district and a church somewhere here right so just that we have a, a general outlining of what we can expect and yeah this is this is really downtown there as well so i would like to keep a high density here right um it makes sense to me so we are going ahead with some very tight blocks and buildings with that Alright, and then here are some more normal looking blocks again. So we can also keep that road there. I might actually just keep this triple road here intact. I don't know for what exactly to be honest, but there will be there will be a reason for it. And then I'm taking the old block there once again. Very good. And this is some proper expansion. And up here we can also go ahead with more blocks. The expedition requires our attention, I think, for the last time. And castaways request your help, but where could they be? Um, shark baiting is a common distraction for your sailors, but the latest catch provided much more entertainment than expected. In its belly was a bottle of survivors. Examine the entrails of the snark of the shark for clues with the schnapps or map the islands. We can do this because we have a frigate and with that the navigation bonus. Let's do that. And your navigator is overwhelmed by the mass of possibilities, unable to agree on a proper searching method, yet alone to find a list of reasonable possibilities. They abandon their task and admit the crew might as well try to work out the contents of the entrails. Alright, I guess we are not going to use this guy anymore for any bigger endeavors. We lose some morale here, we find nothing, and I think that's it. Yes, it is. We have unlocked the new world. Uh, let me just really get, get ahead here and... Have us another block of, of, of houses there, right? Um, like this. Mm, make a, a big block out of this one. And then some more here. Right? Of course, a connection with the main road. And we can have some special entrances then here for these guys. Mm. 
good at that. Uh, with that, a new district is coming to life. I would also like to check then my consumptions, which are fantastic. So I don't need to worry about that. And we still have some building materials. Let's go ahead and also upgrade a few more farmers, especially down here. Two workers for the moment. Hooray! Session unlocked. And with that, we have the new world. There's already Tron Lafetune saying hello. And I can also see right away that, yeah, Miss Hunt already has schooners in the region. That means that she probably, probably has a bit more than just schooners. Um, let's... Isabel Sarmento. Isabel Sarmento. I would never do this. Let's have a look at the northern, southern islands first, because this is the quickest way to get back to the old world, right? There's lots of islands I can see here, and let's just hope that one of these is not settled yet. This would be important. Isabel Sarmento usually also has a clipper for us. Um, yeah, I just need to click on that. Very good. We haven't discovered a pirate yet. That means there is no diplomatic um, interaction with him yet, so he doesn't fire at us for the moment. However, we should not find him, to be honest, because that would be the end of our passive relationship. And the other ship is up here. To the big islands first. There is a flat island. God, it looks like the pirate base to me, to be honest. But we are so close to it, we, we are bound to explore it, I think. Ah, uh, yeah, this is most likely the pirate. And there is Miss Hunt in full force, by the way. Holy cow. A lot of ships. We are losing that clipper now. There is no way. Look at the amount of ships she's got here. The clipper is fast, so should be we should be able to outmaneuver those frigates. We are not. We are already heavily damaged. New yeah, that is a not a good beginning here, to be honest. I still have my frigate, and I do have a clipper. A Let's get Mirabel with some building materials to the new world. The this is a bad beginning. Let's try some 50 tons bricks, timber, and some steel beams. Not much though, and definitely uh, no weapons yet. I don't want to. I don't want to risk my weapons too. And yeah, ship has been lost, and with it, precious starting cargo that is going to put us back in time. Leo has already settled here as well. Trümmerfield, he's calling his island there. All right, why not? The fields of debris. <laughs> and let's continue then over there. It has to be an island that is not settled yet. Another clipper comes out. Nothing I can do with that guy yet. And by the way, we should also use the next clay pit that we have available. Because we need to definitely get more more bricks in, right? We're we're running a bit out there of materials in general. The pirate has smelled my clipper, it seems, because she's now chasing me. Uh, but the clipper is really fast, so we should be able to, to make the, the journey all the way down. And where is that frigate? It's up here again. All right, it's patrolling in this area, so we should be able to still catch it. 18 minutes we still have on it. All right, let's get back to the new world. My frigate. Oh, look at that. Miss Hunt got a whole big island up here. Uh, it has caoutchouc. It has sugar. It has cotton. It is an ideal island, and it is unprotected at the moment. I might actually, I might conquer it to be honest. Well, she hasn't built up the defense yet. Billaway had fires. Interesting to know. Let's rebuild. Everything here is still looking fine. We should theoretically start the beer production at some point now, but unfortunately, I'm, I, I don't have a mind for it. Um, I do have my ship, ship off the line. Let's get this one down to Havisham, because we are going to probably conquer the island of Miss Hunt. That is. The safest bet that I have right now. Uh, let's go back. We're still exploring. More islands popping up. But it is really dangerous in the new worlds. I mean, I kind of like expected things to be busy here, but not that we're getting attacked immediately. Like Miss Hunt has her main base and fleet right in front of Isabel. This is absolutely devastating. This is not good. 
because there's the quests, there's the items, there's the trading happening, and there's also the ships, right? Um, and also my starting ship that was destroyed. A new island, unsettled, caoutchouc, no, sugarcane, cotton, clay, oil. Ah, uh, this is looking promising. It is small. It is a very small one. Alright, there is my schooner, trader, soap trader. Come on, let's break formation and attack this frigate here for good. I'm going to take... Uh, I'm going to take Future Stone here, also down to Havisham. Because I want to have my ship of the line and my frigates going together to the new world. Okay, we're really going in here. That quest frigate is attacking my schooner right now, so we're taking damage. If we lose that schooner, it's not the end of the world. We are going to build more clippers this time, so no schooners anymore for me. It's only clippers at this point. Let's get back to the new world, because things don't stop here. Uh, it's a fine island, but it's it's just too small. He's got no defense here yet, and only a tier 1 trading post, right? So this should be easily takeable. However, she's got lots of ships, so once I enter, I think she's going to chase my ships right away. So we'll have to get in quickly and get out quickly again. Another island. Looks good. Lots of rivers, though. Will be hard to establish something here. But nice beach, definitely, because it looks to right towards the edge of it. This is a this is a very good island, to be honest. But this one here, it, it is not perfect, because we do have rivers, right? And rivers cost you and also make things more hard to build. But in general, it is absolutely no bad island. We got all the resources here that we need. All right, Those we took the frigate for Eli, so let's get the proof and get it over then to his dock. Oh, where is he waiting? Oh, he's waiting in my harbor area, even better. Get my ships back to my harbor. And I would really like to build another ship of the line, however, we do need weapons also for defensive purposes, right? My clipper, and let's head for the new world. Has arrived now down here with the building materials. Very important. And let's jump back right into it. And in that case, I'm going to I'm going to go with this island here most likely. There's still a bit more down here to explore. Go ahead. And let's also go ahead and don't forget to upgrade. I can upgrade a lot of farmers right now. And we should also finish that district. And probably also just upgrade a bunch of them on the other side of the river here now. As the whole thing is coming together have some more room in this area. Might rid of this road. Just make us some better blocks out of that. This. And why not? We have a bit of a courtyard in between them. Just to give you an idea um, what Miss Hunt is doing right now, that's her harbor defenses at this point. I have no idea how that is even possible, to be honest. <laughs> uh, we do have 2,000 in the balance. I would like to at least boost my... Oh! Big fires here right now. My fire station, we can mobilize this. But it's going to take a while. Um, I would like to boost my, my weapon production further. For this, we do need two things. First of all, we don't need the charcoal burners anymore, now that I think about it. Let's turn in the quest there. 13,000, thank you very much. Uh, we don't need that anymore. We do have, theoretically now, the, the coal mine, right? And I would like to use this. There is a coal mine possible here. The coal mine is producing twice as much as the charcoal burner, and it doesn't require any space, really, right? So only a mountain site like this one here, and we can use it just fine. And this is solving a lot of my issues right away. Um, I do need another iron mine. So there's coal, iron, iron. Let's take this one, and we will probably need to upgrade that one. Let's get rid of the charcoal burners here and just have another coal mine instead. Uh, it would be then this one. So 
we can save something. Also, I think, yep, the coal mine does not cause any unattractiveness, right? Well, the charcoal burner does. So we are making things in Vega a bit more beautiful again in my ordinary city. And that's that. So with that, we have a proper output and we can afford two more furnaces. And we're out of timber again. But that's that. Two more furnaces means we can boost our weapon production so a bit further. Am I boosting it already? Yes, we are. But another one should be possible then. Alright. Soap Trader is still doing his, his, job, his job there. Very good. And we probably should work, uh, uh, focus then also a bit of on repairing here. There it is, repair crane. So whenever there is a ship coming in, right, it gets repaired automatically. There you go. Repair crane. Done. Alright, let's head back to the new world there real quick. Another island. Also not a bad one, but worse than the other one. Because less space overall. Beautiful though, right? I love it. We might have a beautiful vacation here if it weren't for the darn sharks, mishunts and pirates. Uh, let's get over there. There's still something to explore. And my frigate is still alive. And where is my clipper? Halfway through, so on its way and should be arriving soon. Because we have to, let's also continue with some city expansion Ship in Villa Way. Another clipper. And let's make this road going over to that side. And there's the end of my endeavors. We're losing that frigate. Out of the fog comes another mishunt fleet. Yeah, I think they're just passing by. They're not chasing us. So my frigate might yet see another day. No, now they're chasing us. Oh, we're still in the patrol. Let's get it over there. And we found another island. This is not that great because there's no coffee on it. Um, the rest would be fine, really. And no sugar cane, so no rum. But other than that, yeah, also building space. There's still some islands available. I'm really positively surprised here. Now, there, she's chasing us now. There is basically no way for us to, uh, to stay alive here. I'm trying to, to get over there and just find us some more islands while we can. But I think it's over anyway. Yeah. And there we lose the frigate. In the meantime though, my clipper arrived and let's get over here to this island real quick and take it. I can also, since we have finished that, I, I will get my fleet over there, or my, my few ships that I have, um, as protection. And another clipper with weapons, right? So we build up some harbor defenses. It's so important right now that we fortify the one island that we have to make the best of it. Um, there we have it. At least two cannons we can get out there. Perfect. I will need some more bricks and let's also take some more steel beams. It's expensive, I know, but it's going to be worth it. Uh, Leo, would you take my money? No. Flattering oh, yes. with Bente worked. Uh, no, they will not. They will not like anything from me for the moment, so we can't do any diplomacy. Attention for the Admiral. Right, ship has arrived. This is a, a, a great moment. It might not be the most beautiful area, right? But it is my area, and it is my tiny island in a very well-protected harbor area with a quick way outwards. So even if we're at war with the pirate, even if we're at war with Hunt, my ship should get out of here as quickly as possible without getting into too many dangers, right? And I, I'm really, I'm really happy about this zone, to be honest. And we can, yeah, we can start with that, settling right away, building us a smaller city in the new world. Stay tuned.